Pink Limited. The following information relates to Pink Limited Manufacturing Company, which was incorporated on 1 March 2019. On 1 September 2019, property and plant were acquired at the following amounts. It may be assumed that these assets were immediately brought into use. Now, first, we're able to identify that this will be our cost immediately brought into use in terms of RS16. We now need to start with our depreciation. We have land of 1.75000, factory building 4 million, and an office building of 2 million. Property and plant are measured in terms of the cost model of RS16 property, plant, and equipment. Pink Limited provides for depreciation on the straight line basis. Depreciation has already been provided for on property and plant and is included in the accounting profit before tax. Important to identify that this is our accounting rules. The depreciation rates are as follows. Factory and office buildings at 2.5% per annum, apportioned for a part of the year. Plant at 20% per annum, apportioned for part of the year. The South African Revenue Service allows the following capital asset allowances. Immediately identify that this is our tax rule. Section 13.1b, 5% per annum on factory buildings on the straight line basis. Not apportioned for part of the year. Now look at this. If we look at the depreciation, the depreciation will be apportioned, apportioned for part of the year. Our tax allowance will not be apportioned for part of the year. Such does not allow any allowances on the office buildings. During the year, the land was sold for an amount of 1.95000 and the profit on the sale was included in the profit before tax amount. The following balance relating to insurance is included in other receivables. Prepaid insurance premiums, now look at this, prepaid insurance premiums, 2022, 40,000, 21, 30,000. These prepaid expense balances were tax deductible in the years in which the expenses were incurred in accordance with section 11A, Redworth, 23 capital H of the Income Tax Act. The profit before tax for the year ended 29 February 2022 amount to 950,000 Rand included in the 950,000 Rand are inter alia the following items. Dividends received not taxable 180,000 a fine for contravention of the Companies Act, not tax deductible, 15,000. Value of inventory destroyed in hailstorm, deductible for tax purposes, 95,000. Donations paid, not tax deductible, 30,000. Revenue earned in the South Africa, sorry, <laughs> in the United States of America, taxed in the USA at 35% and not taxable in South Africa. 150,000. Research costs are 100,000. Correctly expense for accounting purposes. Assume that 150% of this amount is deductible for tax purposes for the current year. Research costs are 38 principles. The Minister of Finance announced during his budget speech in February 20.22 that the normal taxation rates applicable to companies will decrease from 28% to 27% for all financial years starting on or after 1 March 2022. There are no temporary differences other than those that are apparent from the question.